Hey guys, a little bit less than a week into Crafting League, I just wanted to record my progress. Uh, this is a very different kind of playstyle than a normal traditional 3 month league. Especially because I don't typically play solo self found, I typically trade for the gear I need, I craft the gear I need, I sell it, I make profit that way, buy the gear I need. What I did to level mostly was just run heists, like the one you're seeing sped up here. And then just running maps, uh, mostly blues, occasionally rares and so on to get my atlas completed. And uh, just wanted to show here. We have a pretty good community going on. We got a very small amount of people. This overlapped with Mayhem. But um, we got like a good like probably six of us that have been playing. And uh, it's a good crew of people. So it's been fun even with a small crew. I'm in red maps. i um, trying to get my Atlas completed. In a bit here I'm going to go over the gear. So basically um, this is crafting. Everything falls as a white. So as I go through here, you'll see it's not a lot of uniques. Uniques can fall, of course, but it's essentially solo self-found. It's not entirely solo self-found because technically um, we have been able to trade amongst each other. So um, I've done a little tiny bit of trading with the small crew of people, but because it's such a small pool of people, we have mostly um, just crafted our own gear because it all drops as whites. Um, and because it's such a short league, this is only, I think, day six that I recorded this. Um, it's just really tough because, um, as you can see here, as long as you see, nothing's falling as far as rares, magics. Of course, you have to basically hold down alt, and then you'll see the bases fall. You have to take the bases, you have to use augments, transmutes, alchemy orbs, and so on. Bench crafting, um, mostly essence crafting is what I have done. As you can see, I'm running Wintertide Brand. Um, I'm going to go over it a bit more. But um, essentially, this is not, of course, the low life version. It's not the CI version that I've done. It's not the staff version I've done. I've done a tremendous amount of Wintertide brand builds. This one's definitely the weakest. Uh, that guy... <laughs> I like my women thick and my noodles thin, but apparently uh, the guy in second place likes the opposite, as you can see. He likes his noodles thick, like udon, and his women thin. Uh, basically, when it comes to like your six links, you have to kind of get them to fall. You saw a little flash there when I held down Alt. Um, that's the way I get the bases for crafting league. But again, you're not going to have a lot of divines falling, right? In a league like this, it's solo self found. Basically, 95% solo self found. I pondered what he told me, and um, he'll become cultured one day. I'm just running this full run through. You always want to, you know, encourage defenses in leagues like this because you're trying to basically rush to a higher level. And I just did the best I could. I wanted to go more armor and um, energy shield, less of the evasion rating thing. Less focus, I should say, on evasion rating. Sometimes you take what you get in leagues like this. Mostly, again, doing essences. Not really fossil crafting because it's just such a short league. I'd have to do delving. Um, I have a few fossils, but you have to slam a lot of fossils when you're fossil crafting. It's much easier to buy them, of course. Much easier to just buy them in a traditional league. But this is what solo self found is like. The difference being, number one, 20% increased damage across the board. Number two, crafting all the shit you need. You're not going to get lucky rares to fall. Getting all your resistances capped. Um, using crafting bench again. Essence crafting. You could do fossil crafting. It's been fun. But you'll see, um, feels like you have a really, really strict filter on because uh, mostly what's falling is just uh, just currency. Things like that. Been fun. I like this league. I will do it again in the future someday. Um, with a little bit different rule set. And also not overlapping a main league. Um, I had announced my league first, expecting Mayhem to come out a week later. Of course, that was not the case. Not the fastest, of course. I don't have haste. I'm not aura stacking because I'm not low life. You know, I don't have hatred. I don't have zealotry. No haste. No aspect of the cat. Those are all things I use with my traditional setup for Wintertide Brand. And this is only a tier 11, but it's all right. With brands, you get range. You don't have to be in people's face too much. You're going to see here at the end. Um, it's not exactly good for bossing, but... You know, leveling all your own gems and stuff, that's solo self-found. A lot of you watching might play solo self-found, maybe exclusively, maybe you just um, do it on occasion, but it's a very different playstyle. So this, of course, is not a build guide, it's just showing 
the progress I made in uh, in six days. Here's the tree, pretty traditional winter tide brand tree. I went with profane bloom, no extra curse because I just don't have a way to apply it. Um, you can do it with uh, conqueror orbs and so on, but haven't gotten that far. Only on tier 11 maps. Brush with death to keep me alive is the one cluster, and then I did get that as a jewel. Now I do have to show right here, um, I did get a loot explosion. You just have to see this. Look how fucking many scarabs fell, and this helped big time. But look at this. Look how many fell from one arch nemesis. And there's winged scarabs, and there's gilded scarabs like crazy. Look at this. Look how fucking many fell. So what I'm gonna do here is just show I'm um, fighting the Black Star. One of the easiest bosses in the game. This build struggled, you're gonna see. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. Just watch. So with this league, we had a challenge, right? We have the challenges. Uh, number one, first to beat at Ziri. Number two, first to clear the Uber Elder fight. And number three, first to beat the Hidden if possible. Which is crazy, you have to beat all the Breach Lords with Maven watching, and then the Hidden is tremendously difficult. Two of those have been accomplished already by the gentleman in first, Haiji, who is currently in first. The league's not quite over yet at the time I'm recording this, but um, he's 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 most likely going to get first place. You can see just regular old Black Star. So not a build guide, just showing how I did it and um, trying to hit level 90 before the end of the league. Trying to stay up there.